So you probably wonder what we're doing in today's video because I've got the webcam full screen. And that's because today we're doing a review video for the channel. We're reviewing a Mandalorian helmet from Steam Custom Designs. I'll have a link of some sort so you can find them in the description. So here's the helmet. Please note, I did do some work to this because there was some excess on the bottom and the visor was it was all filled in as well as I put some foam pads on the inside so that it would sit a bit more well better on my head it, uh, it's got a nice weight to it and overall it is just a well-made helmet I mean like it definitely was a bit tough to cut the excess and the visor slit out of it so I mean like definitely speaks to the craftsmanship there here it also came with a uh, back vent which goes on the back side of the helmet I'll install that in another video as well as a range finder which I mean like just quickly throw it together there for you which goes onto an earpiece and then just goes up and down so I mean like it'll look something like this on the helmet once it's installed comes came with a couple other parts which one of them is the other ear flap which they have different options of the ear flaps uh, oops stuff bit of the ear flaps which are this and this so let you see it yeah they've got Four different options for those. Bunch of options for these back plates. Uh, they've got two versions of the range finder. They also have a macro binoculars kit. So if you don't want just the one eye, you can actually have a binocular kit in front of your eyes. But I mean, like, it's definitely worth what they charge. So, like, I see that as a completely fair price. So you're not being robbed of your money if you do buy from them. Mm, uh,. If it's coming into Canada like mine did, you're going to get pegged on customs and duties. But I don't mind just because it is such a beautiful piece. Uh, as far as as the helmet kit goes, like once you have it trimmed and sanded, it's ready to paint. Like some of these parts are ready to paint out of box, like the ear flaps, range finder. Like I would have no problem just taking those pieces right out of the box and painting them depending on what you use for paint. 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 Uh, I mean like, you, for customer service, they get a 10 out of 10. Uh, there was some problem where they s texted me pictures of it just before mailing. I didn't get those, but that could either be because I gave them the wrong phone number, so I didn't give them my phone number, or they don't have a US to Canada, Canada plan doesn't matter to me because they more than held up up their end of the deal so completely satisfied with the helmet uh, construction 10 to 10 quality 10 to 10 uh, shipping time well there's no really guarantee on that and even so like it is worth the wait if yours gets held up in custom like mine did or something like that so I mean like I'll cut right now to who uh, a picture of what it looks like out of the box so you can see what you're getting and then they also have different helmet options options that you can buy they've got three different options the foundation which I got the katana and the stout so there's options for you there if you don't want this helmet and then I mean like it's just overall why not that is the question I have why not I don't have an answer for that except just do it. All right, cut to photo. I'll do it right after this. If you haven't liked the channel already, give it a like, subscription, and let me know what I should do for my next video. Thanks. Enjoy the photo and enjoy the outro.